I'm the artist Michael Zotos, and some years ago I was making artwork and taking it into New York City and selling it at the street level. And there were a lot of artists, and some of the artwork was very, very good. But what I found was that some artists would have a situation where they have to sell. They were selling to pay their rent, and when they couldn't, they had to find out what to do. So they'd look around and they'd see who's selling and see what they're actually creating and make that. Now, that's not a progressive way to go, and I'll tell you why. When you make your own artwork, you're developing it out of yourself, and you're creating your own pathway. And when it's not doing what you want, you have to find the way to keep what you are doing and move it forward into a direction. And you find your own vehicles, so to speak, to get it out there and your own way. When you just create what somebody else is creating to sell it, first of all, you're just advertising the other guy, okay? You still have to go through the process of developing the techniques. You have to go through the process of developing the work. You also have to have it out there for a period of time. Nobody just comes out with artwork and, and it starts selling until people know them. They know the, the artists themselves and, and, and the fact that it's their work okay and if you're gonna do that anyway to make somebody else's artwork and basically advertise them you might as well make your own path it's a much more progressive way to go and it also um, you expand your own thinking you expand your own self you're basically surrounding the issue and in the end game that's much more gratifying